everyone, welcome back to another art vlog. Today we're going to be looking at some stickers that I just ordered and I have some new things in the art studio. Yesterday from the day that I'm filming this was my birthday so I have some presents that I can show that are art related and new in the studio. And then today was my son's first day of fifth grade so his last first day of elementary school. It was a little emotional, I'm not gonna lie, I felt some feelings, you know. <laughs> um, but I do have some new things in the studio. This orchid that Ken got me. Some very large canvases. You can kind of see them behind me. They're buy one get one free at Michael's. Uh, so I got those as a gift. And I also got a lovely, back here in this yellow picture, a uh, lovely Monstera plant. And that's my first time having a Monstera. So I'm pretty excited about that. And here are the stickers that I just got in. This one's a ghost cat and this is like a folk flower cat. Sorry for the filming. <laughs> the video quality is not going to be great today because we have uh, flash flooding in the area and it's just been raining non-stop. So it is what it is. Inventory of these. Let's see if we have any extras. Eight, nine, ten. All right, so we have one extra. It's my little cousin's birthday on Friday, and um, her mom ordered her stickers. She asked for my stickers specifically for her birthday to go on her water bottle at school. So I'm going to send her some extras, of course. <laughs> I always try to send at least one extra in all of my orders. And of course, for my biggest little fan, we're gonna have to send a couple. There's five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Perfect. My plan was to list these along with this um, jack o' lantern centangle sticker that I have left over from my old website, um, but I don't. I don't think the the lighting is gonna be right for photography today, so we might have to wait. I think it's supposed to rain the next two days. Uh, Pennsylvania, the state I live in, can be a little, a little wet sometimes.
here they are, the finished pins. They turned out so cute. I am so in love with them. Unfortunately, the video of me painting them got corrupted somehow. So sorry you didn't get to see that process. Let me know if you'd like to see a video of my complete process of making clay pins. As you can see in some of them, I added glitter to the resin and I think it made them turn out so nice. They are so cute. Thank you guys for watching. If you made it this far, be sure to give me a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel where I like to do all art related projects. All right, later gators.